Welcome back. In this video, we're going to discuss the gradebook in My Open Math. And you'll notice that when you get to your homepage, there are two tabs for the gradebook. It is one above, right next to the calendar, on the very top. And the other link is on the left side on your home menu. It doesn't matter which one you click, they both take you to your gradebook. And this is your gradebook. Notice I'm test student. My It gives you your ID, student underscore one two. It tells me my last login and that I have four late passes available. So notice here, um, I didn't do too many assignments. However, it does show the assignments and the grade that I earned and all the assignments for the class thus far. Notice on the very bottom, as you scroll down, there is a totals, past due, past due, and available. It tells you your categories, your chapter quiz, homework, practice quiz, and then your total. Your total is your current grade with the percentages on the right side of the scoring. Past due is your current grade. Past due and available, if you see this column, just shows you that if you decided to work ahead on assignments, what your grade would be if it was included with those future assignments. Again, the past due and available is not your current grade. It just shows you the grade that you would have been you working on future assignments. The past due column is, in other words, your current grade, since those are the assignments that have been incorporated into the course for your grade. What's a nice thing about the gradebook is that it is also interactive if your instructor leaves you feedback. And so if you click Show Feedback, and notice each place in which there is feedback, We'll have a um, hyperlink also, so you can either see all feedback or just feedback for that particular assignment. So notice once I click show feedback, the column changes and it tells me awesome job test student for my chapter quiz. And then for my practice quiz, it says you are ready for the quiz, good job. Um, the second part of the interactive gradebook is that your scores are linked directly to your assessment. So for a quiz for chapter 10 radicals, I can click on my score and it brings me right to my assignment that I completed. And you can see that my feedback and my score on the bottom. I could do it also for practice quiz for chapter 10 radicals and I can click it and notice it'll show me my answers and the problem. Of course you'll be using your gradebook a lot to see your current grade. 